Hello everyone, and welcome back to DMG. Today, I'm going to be showing off a game that I actually made, because my channel is called Davis Makes Games, and I haven't been making a lot of games lately. <laughs> but this, this game is going to be used as a benchmark, actually, in future videos. The truth is, I made it a long time ago. Let's see, what's the what's the date on this? Oh, okay, so it's the date that I copied it to the computer, but I actually made it in about 2017. This was the first Unity game that I ever made. So it was basically me kind of dragging around the... <laughs> I didn't even know how to name it at the time. It was pretty much just me dragging around the, like, like the objects in the tutorial. Like, like there's just like a random piece that sticks through the wall here. I'm going to turn on frame rate counter. And I'm actually going to be beating this uh, in this video. I'm not going to make any cuts just to prove that I've put too much time into this. Oh yeah, and if I take any damage at all, I'm ending the video. You see, having programmed their attack patterns, I know the I know their patterns pretty well. Oh yeah, that's another glitch. There's actually two sets of stairs there. I I mean I assume. <laughs> and they like intersect with each other, so there's like that artifacting effect. Boom. Okay, that was kind of a bad idea, not gonna lie. No! What is that? Okay, okay. I'm gonna restart. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, yeah. I'm just gonna jump. I'm just gonna jump off here because... You see, I haven't played this in a while. <laughs> Oh yeah, and there's just like stuff sticking through the bottom of the map. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna restart. I was a bit too confident when I said, uh, you know, when I take damage, the video ends. I haven't played this in quite a while. I am working on a sequel that isn't, you know, as hastily made. But yeah, I was I was going to say before I was so rudely interrupted by my own death that I'm declaring this game freeware. And if oh come on, I took damage. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Look, I'm on it full. But yeah, I've declared this game freeware. And if for some reason you do want to play it, uh. Put it in the comments and I'll give you a OneDrive link. But yeah, I'm gonna be using this game as a benchmark because it actually is fairly demanding. Not because it's graphically impressive, but because it's not very well optimized. That's another bug that I needed to fix. You can see shadows of things, like, through ramps and stuff. Oh wait, there's a guy there. I don't- I don't want to fly into there. Never mind. Bad idea. I know how to play games, I promise. Actually... They can't look up! I had forgotten that! Oh, it's a gun I already have. Okay. I was really excited there for a moment. Hey. Oh, that was smoother than I thought. Ah. Okay, okay. How did I take damage from picking up a health pack? <laughs> so basically, as soon as you launch that, you run. Because, uh... Oh my god, they are both so low. 
Okay, good. That, that hit them both. I think with a bit more practice in a while, I'm gonna do a, a video of, like, if I take damage, I have to do something bad. Because I'm confident in my ability in this game. It's just been a year or so since I've played it. I meant to do that. I didn't want to hit him anyway. Oh! Can I get a third one? Oh. No. Oh, okay. Okay. I'll just I'll just do it this way. Do what our forefathers did. No. 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 Stop. Bad. Is bad. I don't even know what was shooting me. I think just by looking at you know where objects are placed. You can tell that it was definitely made by a first-time game developer. I remember the strategy for this one was to, like, then boom, then boom. Yeah, okay. And then there are two bots up here. I don't know why I did that, but the second is almost impossible to kill at all, but especially without taking damage, so... Oh, God. Yeah, and then there's this little guy that... Oh! I did it! Okay, where's the... Okay, there it is. But yeah, what I was saying about the uh, optimization and using it as a benchmark. I'm not really getting many frames for, you know, what the game looks like on a GTX 980, which is, you know, pretty powerful. So if I'm benchmarking much weaker cards, this game is a good test of, you know, like, indie game titles, that kind of thing. Alright, that's it for this game. I win! Wow. Okay, um, there's no, like, X button, so I just alt F4. Then one that I literally just called Lego Game. This was from about 2019. Yes, I've been working on a sequel for this as well. That's a bug. That's not supposed to be stuck in the ground. And I only realized that after I uh, exported the final game. Okay, I was I was off the platform. How did I not die? I didn't actually implement the system where picking those up does anything. So you can go, like, not pick them up and it will happen. You still win anyway. But I'll probably also use this one as a benchmark, you know, as well as games that people actually play. Let's see. Because the uh, the next video on the channel will actually be a GPU test. It's been a long time in the making. Oh yeah, I put copyrighted music there. <laughs> So hopefully me talking over it, you know, made that not a copyright claim. But yeah, next video on the channel is a GPU test. It's been a long time in the making. Uh, whew, I've spent quite a while on the video. And I, it wasn't just the actual hardware, it was also the research. Oh yeah, there's also copyrighted music here, so I hope you keep talking. But yeah, I did some research. I did... A lot of tests. A lot of tests. Oh yeah, and I didn't name this one either. But yeah, uh, that's it for this video. Thank you everyone for watching, and uh, see you next time.